Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today, uh, we're just starting. We're gonna be showing how cool arcades are do the internet. So, let's go ahead and figure this out. Alright, let's go ahead and I want to show you this. Well, we're in the. If you guys could see this, this is all for you guys. You guys have to get this. Then, Miss Pac Man Quarter Arcade by Num School, if you guys heard of it. I know I just installed V Recorder because I want you guys to see if you can subscribe more. If you guys are new here, click that subscribe button, please. And like the video. <clears throat> I'll be showing you some other stuff too. Like I was gonna make a video, but my 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 friend named Jacob Adams Rakodamni called on me, so we could play. He calls at the wrong time sometimes, but yeah, yeah. Let's keep reviewing our our stuff for we. Until he calls me again, because I know he's not really patient. Next up, we have this image of the same thing. Just Geek US. 155.99 over there. Alright, now I'm just go. Sorry, I can't show my face cam in Num School. It doesn't say how much it costs right here, but. What the heck? Okay, did you guys are, have you guys seen this right now? It looks like I'm touching the arcade. But I'm not. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure it's still 150 in Amazon. So I don't, I'm not gonna order it from most. My dad might not order it from uh, um, Nope, school. Amazon is better. GameStop used to have it, but now it's out of stock. There's the back of it. This is arcade went up. Alright, then don't forget the arcade does light up. That's awesome. And this, I can't really tell what this is, but this is this this is still the same one as a Pac-Man one. Here it is. That's cool guys, right? But it's expensive if you guys have 150. Maybe your viewers might oh, can also send it to me if you guys want to. But if you guys have 150, you can go ahead and sell it to me right now. And what is this? I never thought of this one. This is another one, but I never heard of it. Guys, if you guys saw this one before, make sure to leave a comment down below and think what this is. It's just too awesome. Next, we have three of the collections. We got mostly there's this girl right here. She was excited about the Laxian of the image. You saw the one from the top, the very first top. Yeah.
And then Pac-Man, Miss Pac-Man, and Galaxy. There's a part of the series. Those are all the one of the quarter arcades. There's more. Then the 40th anniversary is the exact same thing as this uh, original Pac-Man arcade. I just wish I had my hands on that thing already. <laughs> And what else do you guys think of this? And over here, I used to go to this restaurant called Stocks, and I played through that arcade a bunch of times. Every time I come there, I played with that, but they got rid of that arcade. Probably had to repair it or something. But you guys, if you guys have this one, if you guys went to the arcades and went and got this one, make sure you leave a like or comment down below. What else do we have is, there's both of the images, another arcade went up, the party cade, so, we have Miss Pac-Man, so, and the Miss Pac-Man tabletop, but it's arcade went up, so, those other games. I don't know over here is the original Pac Man arcade. So it's not. So it's technically not the quarter. The quarter scale arcade. It's just like. It does look like the quarter scale arcade, but it's not. It has to be. It's That one's way bigger, so. And if you guys never saw the back of an arcade, probably that is the back of the arcade. You guys could check that out if you guys saw the bigger one. Probably that is the back screen. I can't tell how they how Numsco did this. And Bandai Namco has teamed up with Numsco so they can make that arcade. But to make sure, it's like the same ROM and all that. If you watch, if you watch my videos of the basic form of Pac-Man, if you guys like that one, I know it's, in Walmart, it's $44, I just picked it out, and $99, $44.99, so. It must be a little bit expensive. If you guys saw... If you guys don't know that I installed Miss Pac-Man on, on this, on my other phone, you can guys, I'll show you a game, a gameplay, and then I have to install V Recorder in order to, like, show you it. But there's a problem that I won't go on my gallery, so. I don't know if I will be able to upload it, but I can. Absolutely upload it. Now I know how to upload. I can be able to do things about. Like, look at this. I saw this in Target, but it was a little bit expensive, so I just left it alone. And I already have the Pocket Player. So, I'm just waiting for the quarter scale arcade. And watch Geek Dad Life, and you'll see what the gameplay looks like in, in actual real life. So, and this over here is the Miss Pac Man Tiny Arcade. I played with this for like a while. I have this, I played with it a lot and never stopped. So, I got this like birthdays ago, so I don't really need to buy that anymore. Yeah, so. My dad usually buys all the stuff. <laughs> and over here, this is, the artwork is a little bit different in order to the other arcades. Look at the side. Do you see Blinky? Blinky looks exactly good, but in his pack bag, looks different. Even in the front. And you can see that, there, that there's a little bit of white coming out of the gold. So I can't tell it's on Blinky or... I know it's on Blinky, but I don't know, I do not know what, how they did that, like, Bandai Namco made the, 
they teamed up, so. If you guys want to get at the quarter scale arcade, you, you want to guys just sell it to me if you guys have one. And over here, I went to the NES and I sold this. So that's cool. They got the Pac-Man and the bigger yellow one and then that one, that brown one, and the that one next to the yellow one. It looks different. If, does that look different to you? Oh, yes, it is. And then there's one more, the tabletop. Those are my favorite. My mom said the tabletops are, are more better than the arcades. Because you can sit down and all that. You don't have to stand up. It's better like this. Like, you can see the screen. But if you guys want to get the arcade one up, it would be way better than any other type tabletop. So. And here's the mobile screen on Miss Pac-Man. I played, I played mo mobile Pac-Man, like I just said. Miss Pac-Man 2, even though there's Miss Pac-Man 2, so. If you guys, there's Midway, Midway version, and there's a Midway version is just like other arcades that have been made. And over here, I just found this image just right now, guys. So, I just found this. I I just found Donkey Kong. I played Donkey Kong before, but I don't really play it that much anymore. I have the mini arcade on my hand right now, but I can't see. So, you guys, it's just showing you guys, like, what's other arcades and all that. But if you guys want to see other arcades, you want to... You want to let me know in the comments. I'm going to show you just a few more. And then we're going to we're gonna take it off for the day. So. Next. We have Dig Dug. The quarter scale arcade. I I want Dig Dug. I played it before. Dig Dug is my favorite. And here's the Midway. This is, my, this is the old version of Miss Pac-Man. So. I think this is another quarter scale arcade. There was a tiny one. And it's mid Valley Midway, so it's that's where it was made. I know this video is taking forever, but that's that's why I said I'm gonna take show you a few more before I end the video, so what else? And this it's expensive. I'm not, I can't really get that. And there's no room anywhere in this house for me to put that arcade. That one's huge. I don't even have enough room. So, I don't have enough wires either, so that's the problem. You know, oh, look, it's a little girl playing it. That's cool. I know, like, that thing is expensive. I wonder why. Well, it's expensive. I wonder why. I know why, too. Because it's expensive and it's like, uh, it's, it's the original romp and all that, so... And it's exactly like the arcade. But it doesn't say Bally Midway in one of them. And over here is the quarter scale Pac-Man arcades over here. If you guys can see the image on the top. And there's the, the arcade. And this is the girl that I was talking about. Right there. You see her with the, with the blue jacket. I gotta go all the way down now. Well, it's technically... Not actually too expensive, but it is expensive. I kept going down so I won't lose where I left off. And what the heck did they do to that Pac-Man arcade? That Pac-Man arcade? Uh, uh, or this Pac-Man maybe? I, I don't know. They probably changed the arcade to Miss Pac-Man. There's no longer Pac-Man, they just changed it. Yeah, this is where I stopped. If you guys would see, alright, we're going to show you like five more and then we're done today. Uh, let's see. This is the, the 40th anniversary Pac-Man. And there, this joystick is so cute. And then if there's one, one Pac-Man, that's player one. Player two, so there's two players in that. Once you press two, that, those two Pac-Mans. And here, they just someone took an image of this, of the... And Miss Pac-Man Valley Midway over here, so it's cool though. If 
And he is Pac-Man Plus. I know I heard of Pac-Man Plus too. I played it. I played it like a very long time ago, guys. I'm not kidding. And over here, we have the Pocket Player. I also have that too to let you know. It's so cool. Like, it's awesome. It's just a cool Pocket Player. You can even bring it with you all this and any time, like the, like the Miss Pac-Man Tiny Arcade. It's better. And the Miss Pac Man Tony Arcade or Key Light stuff, that's cool. This is why I like the Miss Pac Man Tony Arcade more. More than the more than this one. Well, it is it, it does have um it was so close to getting the original romp, but it it forgot about like the bottom size. Like let me show you. The uh, there. Where the quarters are, and then Miss Pac-Man and those two ghosts down there. And they're... Yeah. They, the... The arcade classics they didn't add that because they had to add the on and off switch. So... Yeah, they were super close though. They did a good job with the artwork. And... And... I think this is our la second thing to show you. And the last and final thing is going to be shown just right now is the Galaga Quarter Scale Arcade. I like this one. I like Galaga too. So, I really like Galaga because the problem is like, there's also a mini arcade version of it if you guys want to get it. More than a quarter scale. Okay. And that was it for today, guys. If you guys want to end the video for me, please, if viewers, if you guys have that arcade, one of you viewers, or if you got, if you got double, like, quarter scale arcade, so maybe, yeah, if, but I can't, like, just let me know in the comments if you have it, so I can be able to tell my dad about that and see what he says. Alright, everyone, see you later, everyone, I'll see you next time. Bye.